Hey everybody, welcome to Stumped. This is Ash, joined by Rick and Jasmine. Hello. Hi. And we're playing more of the Yogg. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty fun. It is fun. Yeah. I like yeah. it a lot. Right. Okay, so. I'm going to be the red lady this time. Um, Oops. I'm going to be the, the fancy lad. Dixon. I'll be the red lady. Oh, I thought you meant the, the red dude. No, <laughs> red lady. Um... I guess I'll be her again. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You cannot not be a wizard or no, a I'm not gonna be a magician. Wizard. I'm not going to do that again. But her hat, just, you have to it be does, a magician. It does, you know? Yogg's going to be here in six weeks, guys, and no one expects it. Not one of us. No one. Just keep living our lives week by week, unaware. All right, so this one is you, Jasmine. again. Um, <coughs> let's go to the slums. Okay. I'm going to fight crime. Fight crime. Fight crime. Wow. <laughs> Spend the week outsmarting and beating up criminals. I'm Batman. You gain one mind, one physique, and one finesse. One night you hear cheering coming from an alleyway. Peering in, you see the crowd of men cheering on dogs while they're ripping apart. Oh, God. Oh. Dog fight. One of the men spots you and asks you, Oi, would you like to participate in a little button game? I'm here to fight crime. No, I'm going to stop the dog fight. You try to convince the gamblers that dog fighting is wrong. Your words fall on deaf ears. Very quickly, they get angry with you. Yeah, you got no charm. <laughs> One of them walks up to you and pulls out a knife. Oh, shit. You don't feel like you got the strength or speed to match this guy. You run away hoping he won't follow. <laughs> <laughs> You're the most awesome. You ain't that strong yet. Yeah. I'll go back. I'm uh, Batman. Who's this? this is you, Rick. Yes, this is me. Um, I'm going to go to Ye Old Tavern. Okay. And I'm going to drink. <laughs> you spend the entire week getting wasted. You gain two charm and one physique. One day, a fortune teller sets up at one of the tavern's tables. She offers to read anybody's fortune for a small sum. Uh, I don't have any wealth, so I'm going to have to say, no thanks. The rest of the day, you watch the fortune teller from afar as she showers each of her customers with promises of wealth and love. You feel like skipping out was a good choice. You gain one mind. Nice. Yes. Being broke. Pays off. <laughs> um, I don't know what, what do I want to do? Um, I'm going to go to the hospital, and I'm going to tend to patients. You spend the week diagnosing and tending to the sick. You gain two mind and earn one wealth. One day, the bloodletting leeches somehow oh, escape shit. from their containers. Leeches start flooding into the hallway. Oh my god, that's gross. There are people screaming everywhere as leeches slither towards them. That's not really what leeches do, though. <laughs> Somebody do something! Yells one of the doctors. Does it have to leech us with my magic? I've got five magic. It's not very high. Use yourself as bait. I don't know, Ash. What do you want to do? I I'm going to be the foolhardy hero. You start taunting the leeches and lead them back into their containers. The leeches swarm all over you. Gross. You are subject to vicious series of bites before the leeches get bored and take off. <laughs> you lose two physique. Oh. The leeches make their way out of the hospital and end up infesting all of the nearby waterbeds. <laughs> Good job, Ash. You really So are these like waterbeds like the beds from the 80s? Like uh, actual <laughs> beds made of water? I, I think it's, you sure. know, swamp lands. You know, oh. Waterbeds. Like rice okay. paddies? Yeah. yeah. Um... They say the last time it came, the Yogg devoured houses whole, stole lives, tore families and family members apart. But that was so very, very long ago. Jazz. Um, I need to get my physique up. Yeah, if you really want to be a fine cri a, a crime, crime, crime fighter. Get the physique up. Finesse and physique. Let's, um... Let's go to the woods. The woods? Yeah. Okay. Now I chop wood. Chop wood. That's gonna do yeah, it. Yeah, you spend the week cutting down trees from the village. Two physique, and you earn yourself one wealth. You see, I got some physique. One day you hear hundreds of footsteps running through the forest in your direction. Hundreds? It's an orc raiding party. What? Whoa. Crap. What do you do? Um. You don't have enough charm to charm them to kill <laughs> not killing you. I'll hide. <laughs> you jump into a nearby ditch. Unfortunately, your bright clothes signals. Oh, and they capture you. In your holding cell, you contemplate the weight of your own mortality. <laughs> you lose a mind. The next morning, the oaks are all gone, and your cell is unlocked. What happened? What did happen? 
<coughs> okay, okay. Here's what I'm going to do. Yep, that's where I want to go. Palace? Yep. And I'm going to attend a ball. You spend the week attending fancy gatherings. So fancy. You gain two charm and one finesse. One day, you overhear the jester tell a joke to a group of people. Everyone laughs, but you didn't understand the joke at all. Uh, I'm going to try and figure out the joke on my own. Several hours later, you figure it out, and a small chuckle is had. <laughs> all that thinking gave your mind a workout. You gain one mind. Well, she didn't have to explain it to you. It was fist sticks. It was fist sticks. Um, okay. I will... What will I do? Um, what are you going to do? I'm going to go to the garden and meditate. You spend the week in deep meditation. You gain one magic and two mind. Walking past a pond one day, you see a fat little frog sitting on a lily pad. You're going to kiss it, aren't you? Please, sir, the frog begs. I'm not a frog at all. I'm an enchanted prince. If you could see your way to kissing me, it would break the curse and return me to normal. Kiss the frog. I want to kiss a frog. Kiss the Come frog. On, I'm totally going to... Uh, Catch the frog and uh, sell it as a I, talking I frog. I feel like I'm fairly gullible and foolhardy already, though. I'll kiss the frog. You bend down and kiss the frog. You feel a curious stirring, like a curse trying to break. Unfortunately, you don't seem to be magical enough to get the job done. The frog thanks you for your efforts and hops <laughs> off sadly. You wake up the next morning with a bad case of lip warts. You uh, lose one charm. Oh my god, things are not working <clears> out <throat> for you. It was on us in a heartbeat, or so the story goes. The earth shook, the air went still. My turn. I want to get out of that forest. Yes. Um... Let's go back to the slums. I'll get some more physique. Let's fight more crime. You spend the week <coughs> outsmarting and beating up criminals. One mind, one physique, and one finesse. One day you notice a man drawing water out of a well. Suddenly leeches- Oh god, your leech is ash! <laughs> <laughs> leeches begin pouring out of the well and cover the man from head to toe. They start making their way towards you. What do you do? I have no magic. Um... You can try to lure them as well. That was my foolhardy mistake. Shh. Let's try to blast them. Okay. You wave your hand, unleashing a wave of magic to disintegrate the leeches. Your magical bit is what you thought. Your spell fizzles out before it even reaches the leeches. The leeches form all of you. Damn it! Ah, these uh... leeches! Two physique! Oh, I just lost my physique! Oh. Um. to the man was... Is he dead? Nothing is left but a pile of bones. Oh, oh god, these leeches! Ew. I'm ruining the town with these leeches. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Wait. where am I going to go now? Hmm, I'm going leeches. to go to... Well, let's see, what are my stats right now? Quite charming. I keep building up that charm there. And your mind is pretty high, too. Um, I'm going to go ahead and stay at the palace. Okay. And attend a ball. You spend the week attending fancy gatherings. You gain two charm and one finesse. One day, you accidentally bump into a duke. Watch where you're going, you filthy peasant! He shoves you out of the way with his hand and continues walking. Hmm. <laughs> passive aggressive or active aggressive? I'm gonna go passive aggressive. That outfit looks really comfortable. He looks mildly insulted. Sick burn! <laughs> you gain one charm. Nice. Yeah! That outfit looks comfortable. I bet it wasn't comfortable. Huh? 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 Um. Okay, so. Nothing's really worked out for, for me. Burn. You should fix your leeches, because this is. Yeah, I'll go back to the hospital and tend to more patients. You spend the week diagnosing and tending to the sick. You gain two mind and earn one wealth. One day, a patient whose voice has been cursed and replaced with piano notes will not stop talking. All the other patients are complaining that his voice is making the hospital even more depressing. about this guy. Old piano notes is back. The doctors have tried convincing him to stop talking, but to no avail. I'm going to try to decipher it. You 
you listen to his piano keys and manage to work out that he, all he wants is for his pillow to be fluffed. Fluff those pillows. <laughs> you fluff his pillow for him and he sounds extremely grateful. And to charm! <laughs> Couldn't he not fluff his own pillow? <clears throat> and then the world was a howling fury. Chaos, screaming, the sound of all we knew being pulled in half.